And I have a kiss. Oh, good girl. <laughs> Daddy kiss. I was like mind blown that it had worked. 六岁的欧布三弟有遗传性失聪，一出生就因为听神经病变，无法听到任何声响。但他在接受注入复制基因的突破性手术后，不但能清楚听到鼓声，听觉还达到接近正常水准。That was 24 weeks post surgery, and we heard the phrase near normal hearing. She was turning to really soft sounds. Yeah, we, we they played us the sounds that she was. Turning to, and we're quite mind blown by how how soft it was, how quiet it was. Like they're, they're sounds that I think in day to day life you might not even notice yourself, sort of thing. Rather than delivering a big dose of gene therapy to the whole child and and thus risk、uh, side effects from 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 big doses, which, which have been seen in 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 other gene therapy trials, we're just delivering a tiny dose directly to the inner ear, and that operation is very similar to doing a, a cochlear implant. So in fact, it's it's just drilling a hole through the、um, temporal bone, which is behind the ear,、um, and we pass a catheter in, and then there's just a short infusion of a tiny tiny volume. Of、uh, gene therapy. Obo 接受的是国际性基因治疗的临床实验，宗旨是为了帮助因为各种遗传疾病受到听觉困扰的孩子，让他们逐渐恢复听力，甚至有机会完全恢复正常听力，不再需要透过助听器或设备的辅助。We can start to use gene therapy in young children, restore hearing from a variety of different kinds of genetic hearing loss, and then. Uh, have a more one-and-done type approach where we actually restore the hearing. We don't have to have cochlear implants and other technologies that have to be replaced. I think we've been given a really unique opportunity with no real evidence that any harm or adverse effects was likely to come to her. And I think a lot of parents, with regardless of their difficulties their children face, to be given an opportunity to potentially. Make obstacles easier for her to overcome was a risk, definitely worth taking.